Hey, today is my first day making a video. I'm basically starting a video blog about my um my um getting back to healthy. So uh, my name Lorraine, but you know I go by Hustle Guy because I be hustling my blood off trying to make my life work either for my health or for my wealth. So basically, um. What happened is uh, in 2012, I was diagnosed with uh, CVS, um, also known as uh, cyclical vomiting syndrome. And um, I guess it's something that I was born with. It's like a mitochondrial disease or something. But it was kind of dormant and didn't really bother me so much. But uh, I, I guess my diet and my lifestyle eventually led up to it getting so bad that I was um, I couldn't hold down foods and take down nutri nutrients uh, enough on a regular basis and so my body started getting weaker and weaker and um, my blood pressure started getting low and I wasn't able to get oxygen through my body and through my blood to my brain um, efficiently and uh, I was in digestive failure because uh, without enough oxygen to my blood and to my brain, my body didn't have enough energy to do like the basic essential things that it needs to do to survive. And I was get basically in fight or flight mode, I guess we call they call in science. And um, my body was taking all of my energy and using it for the things that I needed to just sustain you being able to wake up every day and be alive just the basic things heartbeat um um blood acid alkaline regulation um ph balance blood ph balance regulation um uh endocrine system function hormone function um, um using enzymes um dna breakdown you know taking in um resources nutrients and uh and getting rid of those nutrients um so basically, I went into digestive failure. Everything, my body was so weak that it didn't have enough energy to digest food. That was just too extra. And the food that we eat nowadays is so toxic. So what was happening to me was that my body was filling up with toxins. And I wasn't able to get rid of them because uh, CVS comes with IBS, which is a, a condition called irritable bowel syndrome, which is part of the digestive system failure. So my digestive system was failing and my excretory system was failing. Failing. That's the system that excretes the toxins, urine, bowel movements, stuff like that. That was, that was also in failure. So I, I could take in some nutrients and force myself to take in some nutrients, but now I done took in all these toxins and now my body is stuck with these toxins in my body so now i don't got oxygenated blood flowing through my my body i got toxigenated blood flowing through my body and so now my body has no energy and so it can't do the things that it needs to do so it's taking my essential things that i have and it's using it just to wake me up every day every day i was waking up with headaches and stomach aches and it, it took me forever just to even try to find my balance to open my eyes um so anyway, about a week ago, well, anyway, let me let me just get back to the food. Um, the food was so bad, it was so toxic, and it built up in me over such a period of time that it just shut my body down. My body could not take in no more toxins because because they couldn't release the toxins fast enough to keep me healthy. So I couldn't eat a lot of times because I would have a really bad indigestion. Cause my body couldn't digest the food so it was it was agonizing painful uh man so i um i was deficient in the vital nutrients just to survive and so about a week or two ago my lips was purple my face was dark my skin was dry and crackly uh i was having seizures and strokes um muscle spasms i couldn't hardly talk i couldn't hardly walk i was two breaths from death that's what i would say and so um i was just praying and uh uh some ladies from the church prayed and said a healing was gonna come and um one day i got sick and my mom said she was on her way and she was on her way 
to be continued. You go check out the rest, part two. I'm gonna finish recording part two right now, and then from there, I'm gonna go on to the next video.